Hello everyone. Today in this video you are going to learn the differences between KOB1 or KKBC underscore RD and you will realize which transaction code should be used for overview of cost of production order. KOB1 and KKBC underscore RD are both SAP standard transaction codes and the reports extracted from these T codes can be exported into spreadsheet. KOB1 is display actual cost line items for orders. KKBC underscore ORD is analyzed order. The first difference is in KOB1, you can extract details for multiple production orders at a time. While in KKBC underscore ORD, you can only view detail for a single production order at a time. The second difference is in KOB1, you can view actual production quantity. While in KKBC underscore RD, you can view plan quantity, target quantity and actual quantity of a production order. In KOB1, you can view actual cost for material, machine hour, labor hours and factory overhead fixed and variable. While in KKBC underscore RD, you can view total target cost, total actual cost and total variance for materials, machine hour, labor hour and factory overhead, fixed and variable. Now we will see these differences through the display of both the transaction codes. As you can see in KOP1, here you have to enter the production order number. This block gives you the provision to enter more than one production order number and you can simply mention the posting date and you can execute the report. But in the display of KKBC underscore RD, you can see that there is no such field available here where we can use to enter more than one production order number. So you can here mention a single production order number and view its detail accordingly. The second and third difference in KOB1, you can only view the total quantity, which is the actual quantity and the value which is available is actual for material, labor hour, machine hour, factory overhead, fixed and variable. But in KKBC underscore ORD, as you can see in the display, that total plant quantity, total actual quantity, total target quantity for production is available. And similarly, total target cost, total actual cost and the variance is available. So these are the differences between KOB1 and KKBC underscore RD. So if you have to view a single production order at a time, so you can use KKBC underscore ORD. But if you have to use or view multiple uh, production orders at a time, so you have to use KOB1. So that's it guys from my side. I hope you like this video. Kindly like, share and comment and do subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much.